Hi everybody, I'm Danny Dancer. I'm the Kidtropolis Educator at Children's Museum Houston, and today I'm gonna show you an art project that we call Funny Faces. This is actually what we are doing right now here at the museum, but you can do this at home really easily. All you need is a long piece of paper. This is called legal sized paper, but you can just take a regular piece of paper and cut off the end so it's a little bit longer than normal compared to its width. And then you need something that you can write, color, or draw with. So I'm gonna use markers here today. Now, here's my example. Now you might notice this piece of paper is a little bit smaller. I've just drawn this cute little fish. Isn't he sweet? Oh, he looks so nice. Rawr! Oh wait, I'm, let me do that one more time. Ready? And rawr! I know, he got very, very scary when I opened him up. So he has this little secret surprise inside. So I'm gonna show you how you can make this at home. We're gonna start off with our big piece of paper and we're just gonna fold it in half from that top part down. Just like that. Then we are gonna take one end and we are gonna fold it up so that that top line meets the fold, just like this. So this is it folded in half, and then I just took this little bit and folded it up like this. This is where I'm gonna draw my creature. Now it can be a person, it can be a fish, it can be a rabbit, it can be any animal, but we wanna make sure that it takes up the entire space and that its mouth goes right here along the line. So I'll show you a really quick example here. If I have a face like this, there we go. Here's my circle for my head, basically. And then I can make the mouth Go right along this line here. And there's the mouth. And you'll notice I have a little bit of the line at the top and a little bit of line underneath this fold. That's important because those are going to kind of help guide me when I open this up. Now let's just give him a couple of eyes. Let's give him a little nose. I can't draw upside down. There we go. A little nose and we'll give him some cool hair. There we go. Look at how friendly he looks, right? Now when I open him up right now, this space in between is blank. That is where you are gonna connect your two lines for your face. Just like that. And then I'm also gonna connect the two lines of my mouth like this. Now in between, you can give him, maybe he's sticking out his tongue, maybe he's got big scary teeth, whatever you want just to really draw that attention to this big mouth we have created on our funny face. Again, I'm gonna just do mine really quick and simple. All right, so I just gave him some teeth, I gave him a tongue, I gave him that uvula, that little thing that hangs down in the back of your throat. Um, so this is my guy when he is looking funny face. And then this is my guy when he's just looking chill. And again, you can color the rest. I colored this in really quickly as an example, but this is my funny face here. And like I said, it doesn't just have to be the face. You can do it with the fish if you want, if you just put the mouth on one side or any animal or creature that's sort of turned off to the side. You can just do the mouth on one side of the paper if you want. So this is how you do this at home. I hope you have fun with this project and we hope to see you again at the museum soon. Bye.